Okay, I will be talking about the standing weight and I drew this out and this is the standing weight and one of the, each of the standing weight there is going to be a node, node and an empty node and node will be on the end of each side and an empty node will be this one and there is a pattern that I just have to go a node, empty node, node, empty node, node, empty node. A node to a node, it's a fourth of a wavelength. No, it's a half of a wavelength. A node to an empty node is a fourth. For it to be able to get a whole cycle of a wavelength, it needs a node, an empty node, a node, an empty node, and a node. And this is called a standing wave because waves are moving in two directions. As you can see, there is one direction and there is another direction. And then they need to be the same wavelength. These are two different wavelengths. They need di and these need to be traveling in a different directions. Wave move and it stop where it. Wave move and it stop where the end is and send a wave back to the other direction. So when it's moving, stop there, and then it send it back to the other direction, causing the string to move back and forth, which call reflections. It move back there, it hit back hit back here, it go back to the other way. And, and a node and an empty node, like I said before, that's a fourth. And then when it come around here, that's a one hole. And that is the rule of it. You can you can also have a anti node, a node, anti node, a node, anti node like that as well. But you cannot have an N. You cannot have anti node, anti node, and then a node because that's not the rule of it. The smallest one that you can have would be a node, anti node, a node. <laughs> And any number that has a, either a half or width. If I have 100 to the 9th, 100 to the half, that will work. 50 to the half, that will work too because it's in half. And the formula of the frequency is the N V over 2L.